G'day gang, game audio Dan here, how you going? We're back in the Star Trek Online. We just arrived in, uh, what, Pollux. Let's have a look at this. First surveyed in 202067, Pollux and its sister star, Beta Geminorum, form twin star systems with multiple inhabitable, inhabitable planets. Federation scientists find the planets within both systems to be excellent subjects for radiation and habit habitability, habitability studies. Okay, let's begin communication breakdown. We're here, Captain. The USS Kittimer is dead ahead. Our orders are to make contact with the Kittimer and find out why they've not responded to our hails. Very good. Set a course for the Kittimer. Alright, let's go. Got the Chimera over here. Looking quite nice. I'll approach this. Guess we can go a little bit faster. Hail the USS Kitama. Let's cut through this static. Boost the signal. Yes, sir. I will require approximately 15 seconds to make the necessary adjustments. Understood. What are you both doing here? I am in command of the game all year. Captain Nog ordered me to come with him to your location. Always good to follow the orders of your superior officers. Do you know what happened with your communications? The cadets were ambushed by Klingons. Captain Tagger was killed in the attack, and the ship is under the command of this cadet. The Chimera was escorting them back to Earth space dock, but when we couldn't contact you, I decided to alter course and investigate. What's the situation here, Captain Neal? I'm troubled by the anomalies in this system, and if they're affecting long-range communications, then they're doubly a cause for concern. Let's do this by the numbers. We've already launched nine probes. Now that they're active, we can do an in-depth scan of the anomalies. With all three ships collecting data, we should be able to complete this quickly and formulate a course of action. Any questions? Uh, no questions, sir. I'm confident that my crew is up to the task. You're quite confident for a cadet. You remind me a bit of myself when I was an ensign. Of course, I wasn't commanding a ship back then. Let's see how you perform before you start claiming that chair full time. Understood. You can set your ship's power levels to have a focus on attack, defense, speed, or balance. Oh, 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 okay. Is this a, like a preset? So that's balanced? Can I increase this? Attack. Defense. Oh, it's these three here. Okay. Aha. Speed and balanced, of course, with the scales. <laughs> Alright, so maybe we want to go with a bit of speed. Catch up with those guys. Where'd they go? I lost them already. There's a ring here, but I saw him go... They went that way, right? Oh, here they are. Okay. <laughs> Auto firing, auto firing. Let's punch it a little bit. Catch up with the Kitama. Might have to come to full stop here. So. A little bit further. Investigate what happened to the USS Kitama. 
So that way, I'm not, oh, maybe I'm supposed to go back here. Hang on. I think I got confused. I'm a little bit confused, aren't I? Let me get to that ring. There we go, there we go. That's where you want to be. Scan point alpha. Reports indicate traces of gamma radiation, but there's something off in the readings. Okay. I'll make my way over to the next ring. Fire all beams, fire all torpedoes, fire all weapons. I gotta get used to all this stuff. I should have got some buttons down here. I wonder if I can drag these down. Kenimer here. Are you seeing the same gamma radiation levels that we are? I'm not sure that a normal scan will be enough. We might need to do a full multiphasic reading. We saw the same issue. How can we improve our findings? My chief science officer, Commander Davis, suggests that performing a reverse tachyon pulse wave scan will solve our sensor issue. Perform your final scans, and then report back. Understood. Whoops. <laughs> it's gonna be a shortcut for that. Stop. A little bit more, a little bit more. Deflector dish is realigned for reverse tachyon pulse wave, sir. Picking up a transwarp signature. It's right on top of us, the Borg. Oh no, oh no. Fire. Shouldn't have used those cooldowns. Oh, there it goes. Oh, there's more. All right, shift up. Let's get to our friends. Come on, turn, turn, turn. Let's go. Coming in. We're coming in. Take a bounce. What if I could ram into him? I probably wouldn't be wise, right? SS Kittimer. I am requesting assistance from any Federation vessel in range. I've lost contact with the bridge. I am unable to contact Commander Davis for new instructions. EMH, give me a situation report. The Kittimer is being overwhelmed by Borg boarding parties. These Borg are different than the ones in my history records. They seem disconnected somehow. They're strange, but still quite dangerous. Can you hold, on, hold out? Can you hold out on your own? We have problems of our own to deal with. I am an emergency medical hologram, not a miracle worker. Captain Nog, someone must have activated the EMH from the bridge. If the bridge was attacked in the Borg attack, Captain Nia might have activated the EMH to alert us. The Borg haven't been seen in this quadrant in decades. This isn't a coincidence. We need more information. Collect data from all of the probes. What do you need us to do? All send teams to aid the Kittimer. I want you to finish the scans. We need to know the extent of the Borg presence here. And Cadet, if you or your crew are unable to tackle this, speak up now. 
The Borg can rattle veteran Starfleet officers, and you've already gone up against the Klingons today. I trust my crew. We'll get the job done. Yeah, let's turn them around. Let's get it scanned. Transmit. We have your data, and our science team is analyzing it now. What is the status of the Kitama? Our tactical teams have eliminated the Borg boarding parties on the Kitama. Why do you ask? Can we use the Kitama to help analyze the data? There is an 88.47% chance that you will need my help. Agreed. Can you help the Chimera analyze the data we've accumulated in this system? I have 75 million gigaquads of computer memory and an extensive library of files on military tactics and command strategies. I believe I can spare a few bits of processing power for you. Let's see what we can determine. Borg transwarp signatures detected. This is it. Get ready for combat. Oh my goodness. Slow health. That one too. Switch targets, switch targets. Shields are doing fine. Now, I wonder whether it's better to be further away or closer. Come on, take him out. Take him out. Actually, I should change this, shouldn't I? To attack. Shields are absolute fine. Keep it together, cadets. We beat the ball before. We can do it again. We got more. Oh my goodness, what is that? Multiple Borg Warp signatures detected. It's an invasion force. Now this is no good. <laughs> We're outnumbered. There's no way we can... Oh, where are they going? The Borg are leaving, most likely for a more strategic target. Concentrate fire on the remaining sphere. Yeah, I wonder if it's more efficient to go head on. Or just on the side here. Direct hits. There she blows. Beautiful. Okay, Cadet. Here's how I see it. The Borg are using the Pollux system as a staging area. Our long-range sensors are picking up inbound transwarp signatures. Their most likely target is the Vega system. 
There is a civilian colony there, and if the Borg take it by surprise, they'll have a large population to turn into drones. What is the status of the Kitama? The Kitama was badly damaged. They took heavy casualties as well. Medical tells me Captain Yim was gravely injured, but he'll recover. We're still working on triage and restoring the Kitama's critical systems, which leads me to our next course of action. Yes? I want you to go to the Vega colony and warn them about the Borg. What about you? The Chimera is better equipped to hold off further Borg attacks and assist the Kinema here. We'll do what we can to delay the Borg, but it's going to be up to you to warn the Vega colonists. Understood. We'll set a course for Vega. We have to make our way to Vega as soon as we can, Captain. I just hope we're not too late to warn the colony. Are you ready to go? Captain missions allow you to remotely hail your con- no. That was quick. Hail Nog to report. Uh, yes. Let's go. Depart the system, Elisa. Shields up. Red alert. Oh, that was no good. <laughs> that wasn't good. Can I hail him? You need to warn the Vega colony about the Borg. We'll do what we can to hold off the Borg here and repair the Kittimer. Good luck. Congratulations. Congratulations. Airships travel at warp speed between systems. Combat does not take place in sector space. Tivrel. You can change the officer's name. Oh, okay. Use M to open up the map for sector space. Click on a system to plot a course and set your ship to automatically fly to it. Okay, okay. Right. Uh, that's fine. I gotta find Vega in all of this. Oh, here we go. That makes it easy. Plot a course to the Vega system, Captain. Yes. But let me just have a look at all this business. There's quite a few places that we can go, isn't there? All right. Well, let's go. To the Vega system, yes. I'm just going to fly there like this. All right, what's this? Enable error map. Astrometrics. Okay. So let's do some get some speed going. We're getting there. Oh, here we go. Five light years away. We're coming in. Quantum slip drive. Slipstream drive is not available. Um. Oh, don't we need to slow down? Don't we need to slow down? <laughs> We're gonna crash. The Vega system was one of the earliest star systems to be colonized by humans after the, the development of spaceflight. And the colony on Vega... Nine has been a key point on trade routes since the 22nd century. With the automation of Vega 9's massive cargo dep depots in the mid 23rd century, the planet's population turned from industrial concerns to other pursuits. One of these is the exploration of Delton ruins on the planet that may be able to tell Federation archaeologists much about early space exploration. More than 2.8 million Federation citizens currently reside on the Vega 9. Many in smaller settlements spread across the temperate zone. Vega 9 is proud to send more than a dozen of its young people to Starfleet Academy each year. Begin assimilation of the innocent. We arrived before the Borg. 
Now my heart can start beating again. What are your orders, Captain? Hail the colonies. We have to warn them. Tavrel managed to establish a comm link with Willa Post, the administrator of Vega Colony. It's not a great signal, but it's the best we're gonna get. Putting her through now. On screen. Greetings, Captain. Is there something I could do for you today? The Borg are on their way to this system. You need to start evacuating. Repeat, please. Your signal is breaking up. Did you see the Borg? What about... The Borg are on their way. Maya, you have to evacuate. Come, what just happened? I have lost contact with Vega Colony, sir. Something is blocking all subspace signals in this area. Even our hails to the civilian ships are not getting through. There is a communication satellite nearby. It should boost our signal sufficiently to inform the freighters of the danger and warn the colony. Set a course for the satellite. 